Hello communities, how are you guys doing today? Hope you guys are fine. Okay, please don't fail to tell us on the comment section which topic you would like us to make. I will be at the comment section waiting for you. So our video drop three times in a week. We'll pick out from your comments and make a video out of it. I will not fail to thank our existing subscribers and most especially our incoming subscriber. Please if you do not subscribe to our YouTube channel. Make you to use this opportunity to subscribe to our YouTube channel. As all our educational videos are dropping three times a week. You'll be one of the first persons to get this video. And the next important, don't also forget to put on the notification bell. So our video will be dropping three times a week. Okay, it's very important that we learn how to update our browser because the producers and the companies of these browsers are always tightening up the security feature and um, beautifying the, the user interface. So for us not to be left out in this new development, it's more important that we learn how to update our driver, our browsers. Without further ado, let's dive into this lecture. Thank you. Okay, this is Microsoft Edge browser. Uh, formerly known as Internet Explorer, if you are using the Windows 7, this is known as Windows Ex Internet Explorer. So it's in two, uh, Microsoft 2010, Windows 2010, it's known as Microsoft Edge. So this is how we can update the browser. So you move our mouse pointer to the three dots, horizontal three dots at the right top corner. So when you click on the three dots at the horizontal the top corner, you see what help and feedback. So when you click on help and feedback, you move to the next tab, you see about Microsoft Edge. Once you click on about Microsoft Edge, automatically it will bring out, it will detect an update. Okay, so it will detect an update. So uh, I think my internet is bound. Okay, let me, okay, it's connected now. So you see, checking for update, it's telling you my Microsoft Edge is up to date. So once there is an update and you follow through this process, automatically it should be updated. Most importantly, make sure that you are connected to internet, else it won't work. Okay, so that is how you go about it. So let's go to the next one, which is what? The um, Firefox, Mozilla Firefox. Okay, this is Mozilla Firefox. Same process, same that, same position. So you can see a three horizontal line at the right top corner. So all you need to do is to what? Just click on the horizontal line to bring out this menu. Then you go to help. When you click on help, it will bring it bring out another tab. So you click on about Firefox. Once you click on about Firefox, okay, it will bring out this option. So you see, uh, Firefox is up to date. Are you getting it now? So because why my browsers are all updated. So I want to encourage you. If your browser is not updated, go and do that right away. So we are going now to Chrome, um, Google Chrome. So you see there's three dots so that you can click on help, then click on what about Google Chrome. Okay, once you click on about Google Chrome, it should, it automatically detects checking for update. You see my browser is also up to date on Google Chrome. So these are the three process at which you can use to what check, update your browser and to make sure that your browsers are all updated. Thank you for taking our time to watch out this video. If this video has been helpful to you, please don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. Any topic you want us to treat, please put it on the comment section. As our video drops three times a week, we'll take out from your comments and make a video out of it. Thank you, and see you next time.